Good morning guys and welcome to my channel. If you've been here before, welcome back! And today, we're going to be talking about my attempt at switching to a menstrual cup. I've been meaning to make this video for a long time, but I've had some issues and I wanted to try to resolve those issues before I made this video, but honestly, I'm just having a rough time. So, I just need to talk about it, you know? Alright, so I bought the Lena cup, L-E-N-A, Lena, Lena cup? I don't know, I'll put the I'll put it on the screen and like their logo and stuff. But I bought it over the summer and it came in June or July. And when it arrived, I had just finished my period. I don't know if you remember actually. Uh, I did a video of when I bought it and and like yeah, when I bought it that day. It was on the worst day of my life. I'll link it on the screen or something. I bought it and I've had it since then and I have been trying every period to use it and I just have had a lot of issues. So I'm gonna talk about those issues. So I have had a lot of issues. Now, let me tell you, I was just ending my period. I had like one or two more days left when it first came and I spent like 30 minutes in the bathroom trying to insert it so that I could try it out, you know? And I had a lot of issues. I couldn't get it in all the way. I tried every fold. I know a lot of people are going to be in the comments saying, try this fold. I tried all the folds. I googled folds that they didn't even recommend. Um, and I just like tried to use it, you know? And I just like was having a hard time. So my mom was like, well maybe try next time because maybe since it's the end of your period you're not bleeding enough for it. It's not lubricated enough or something. I don't know. So the next period I tried it again and I tried the folds and I spent another 30 minutes in the bathroom trying to put it in and I just had a really difficult time. So I took a pause, I went and watched a YouTube video, it was 40 minutes long about this girl trying out the Diva Cup, which is not the one that I was trying, but it was a menstrual cup and I wanted to hear like her experience and she had like, she was like showing everything, which was like exactly what I needed, you know? I watched that video and then I tried again. Meanwhile, I was just using pads because I don't I don't know what else to do. So I tried again, except this time I thought I had it far enough, but I like didn't, or maybe when I let go I pulled it out a little more, or maybe I just lost my grip. I don't really remember because it was several months ago, but I let go of it and it popped open too soon and it hurt so bad. <laughs> Like, it was incredible how much pain I was in after that happened. Gave up for that day and I was like, no, no, not trying that again. And so I continued with that period and I was like, whatever, I'll try again next period. So the next time I was on my period, I think I was living in this apartment finally, so it must have been like August. I tried again, I tried in the shower so that I could do all kinds of crazy positions without just like hogging the bathroom or whatever. Um, and I still couldn't get it in, but I made the most progress that I had made thus far with it. I got it about halfway in, but because it had popped open too soon that time before, I got really nervous and like just pulled it out and I just was having an issue. And then September period, I tried again, and the same thing, I got it halfway, got too scared and took it out again without trying to get it in there. And then um, October period is right now, and I kind of halfway tried, but honestly, I'm kind of giving up. I don't know if it's like, if it's too big for me. I got the small size, um, and there is a size smaller, I think, it's called the sensitive one, and I don't know if that means it's smaller or if it's made differently. I just, I don't really know. So I maybe need to try that one, but yeah, I don't know. So I've been bleeding for a few days, just using pads, and I think I'll just try one more time or for this video, and then if it doesn't work, I will, I don't know. I don't know what I'm gonna do, <laughs> but yeah. So that's where I am now. I've tried for several, several months. I really, really, really want to use a menstrual cup. A bunch of my friends use a menstrual cup and they love it and I think it's such a cool product. Like it's such a cool idea. It's so sustainable. It sa saves money. It um, helps the environment and like it's just so cool and I want to be a part of that and I don't want to spend any more money on feminine products honestly. So I really want it to work and I'm really trying. So. 
But yeah, that's where we are now. I don't know, I'm just so frustrated. Especially because it's like $24. It's really good, it's really cool, such a cool product, and I wish that I could use it, and I also wish this camera would just be a little better. Let's try one more time. Or, let's try for the next two days, my last few days of bleeding, and see what happens. Finishing up this video, because I have to edit it today, because... <sighs> also, it's already almost nine, and I haven't started editing, so I'm gonna be go. It's just growing up tomorrow. Anyway, um... I tried a couple more times to put the menstrual cup in and it's just, it wasn't working and also I was going to try again one more time today and do it like live on camera not showing anything just like me and like talking through what I was trying to do but I'm not bleeding anymore so <laughs> that's the end of that so sorry if you wasted your time watching this video but I've, I'm having a lot of trouble with the Lena cup and I just don't really know what to do about it so also it's Halloween and I'm dressed up as David Dobrik so stay tuned for my vlog tomorrow I guess that's all that I have for you today thank you guys so much for watching like this video if you enjoyed it make sure to subscribe so you can join my family hit the little bell to get notified whenever I post a video so you won't miss it and that's it. So have a great morning, and if I don't see you later, good afternoon, good evening, and good night. Also, it's raining. I hope that didn't ruin the audio.